the Australian continent is a vast land endowed with an intriguing diversity of plant life. To many of Australia's early explorers, this rich variety of strange vegetation created an environment so completely foreign they recorded in their diaries feelings of landing in an alien world. The key to comprehending the unique characteristics of the Australian garden is found at the beginning of time. Through the ages, our world has been on an evolutionary path, a path that has transformed, reshaped and recreated the Earth into the world we know today. Before commencing its journey through time, the face of the globe appeared as a consolidated ocean swirling around a single immense landmass. This landmass was later torn in two, creating a super southern continent known as Gondwana land. Australia was a part of that land. From horizon to horizon, a forest of conifers and beaches spread across the Gondwana continent. Spears of sunlight pierced the dense foliage, shooting rays of light into the hushed green world below. Nestling beneath the protective canopy were colonies of ferns sprouting emerald fronds, and beneath this, a soft jade underlay of moss. In amongst the greenery, flowers began appearing to attract insects as winged emissaries for the plant's pollen. These gentle colourful blooms became a more effective means of reproduction than the previous method of leaving their pollen granules to the capricious fancy of the prevailing winds. For the first time, the prehistoric garden blossomed. Though all was in perfect harmony in this primeval paradise, the evolutionary course of the world had been set in motion and a devastating future awaited the peaceful Gondwana land. Forces from within the earth slowly pressed the continental plates apart. Africa was the first to go. Australia soon followed. And with this massive shift in the Earth's crust came major climatic changes, including the freezing of the polar ice cap. The now drifting Australia moved closer to the equator and suffered a dramatic decrease in rain-making weather conditions. Aridity set in and deserts began infiltrating Australia's heartlands. Changing climatic patterns created differing temperature zones, forcing many moisture-loving plants to adapt to the changes or face annihilation. It was this harsh beginning, this desperate struggle for survival, that today gives us the immense diversity of Australia's plant life. <laughs> 